Hello, this is the final of my Christmas or what I got for Christmas video type thing. So basically, it's the 7th of January today and um, I've kind of really forgot to do this. I was meant to do it um, the day after Boxing Day, so that would be in the 27th, but I was just really busy and I didn't get to do it. So I put my sun hat on, even though it's after Christmas and that is quite depressing. And my pyjamas that I had on in that video so we can still kind of feel that I'm in that kind of time zone. Except the lighting has completely changed. I have no light from outside. That is artificial lighting. I'm not very good at it either. Anyway, so I'm just going to start. Firstly, my mum's friend got me presents. And this is from my, not, like, apart from my dad's side, if that makes sense. So, um, she got me a makeup mirror, but I actually have the same one. I don't know if you see it. It's one over there. It's the number seven one. It's just a light up mirror, and I already have one. So, I'm just going to keep hers as a backup because she didn't keep the receipt, so I can't really return it. Um, but she also got me these three canvases. So, this one's just got a nail polish bottle on with it gooing out. Then, this is a makeup brush with just a cracked blush there and then we have a mascara wand as well my brother is so loud so yeah that's what I got from her then my dad he got me a pair of heels that I'd been wanting well I bought them but like I didn't buy them, he bought them for me, but I chose them. There we go, that's what I was trying to say. And here they are, they're just these um, burgundy kind of colour. And they're just a really nice winter, uh, autumn coloured shoe. So yeah, I will probably get a lot of wear out of them. And I know I can walk in these ones, because I have a pair of black ones down there. And these are really good to walk in. Well, better than some of the other ones. I can't walk in thin stilettos. So, yeah. Then, um, from Mac, he got me the... Obviously, all the things that he got me, I'd chosen. If that makes sense. So, this is a Black Track by Mac, and it's their fluid eyeliner. And it's smaller than a paint pot. It's, like, quite small. But there it is. Da -da -da -da. I can't really see that, so it doesn't really matter. But um, I wanted to try out gel eyeliner, and this is my first one. And then um, I was very much into eyeliners this Mac shopping trip. And I've got um, an eye curl in Fascinating, and I have my makeup done there. And the woman used this when I had quite a harsh, like dark eye makeup on. And it really did open my eyes and it stays on for quite long. So yeah, just a white, white curl. It's good. Then from Benefit, I got a new foundation. I got the Hello Flawless Oxygen Wow. This is in ivory and it's still a little bit dark for me. I have really pale skin, but yes. Da, 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 da. Uh, it's. I think it's probably better for the summer time. But yeah, this is good. Then he, my dad, wrapped up me a little sample from them as well. This is just the Batgirl primer. Then what I've been wanting this for ages, and it's the All Night Spray by Urban Decay. I haven't really seen much like effect of it, but yeah, just wanted to try it. Uh, then my dad also got me this blue nail polish. It's a Nicole by OPI one, and it reminded me of Blue Your Mind or is it something like that. I blew your mind from just the normal OPI range, but this was on sale. And it was really similar, and I love this colour, and this is called Loyalty to Royalty. I think it was being discontinued, so. It's kind of got a purple in there. But yeah, really pretty. Then my auntie, so my dad's sister, 
got me a Sarah Jessica Puff, uh, Parker perfume and this is in Covey. And thank goodness because I, lo I think I left my Daisy perfume in Paris when I went on a trip at this school so I was really upset but yeah. This one's quite nice. But yeah. Then she also got me three lip glosses. She got me Fuchsia Obsession, Pure Addict and Forever Sweet. The L'Oreal lip glosses. They're just in this little set. I thought it was really cute. I think that just went like in your eyes because that just hurt my eyes when I did that. But yeah, they're just really nice. Oh, here we go. Then my nan, um, basically I saw these earrings and um, I wanted them for prom, so she bought me them. I'll just take the little thing out. Here they are. They're really pretty, simple earrings and I like how they're rounded and they're not like really, boom, I'm wearing big earrings. Like, not that big. So, yeah. But they are just really nice. Um, and that's what I thought I was getting from my nan. I thought that would have been the only thing. But um, then last year she got me this Ted Baker purse, and it was a small one, about that big. And it it was like red, and it had pink inside, and it had butterfly lining, and it was absolutely stunning. And I actually said to her, I was like, Oh my god, when I'm older, I'm gonna get myself a big one because I really like it, and I want some more space for cards and just more as in coin space and I opened this box as in like I'm wrapped to find this box and I was like oh my god Nan oh my god and I opened it and this beautiful purse is in there I was like what I was like oh my god Nan I love you um, and it's just like a pinky lavendery colour and I love the little, you know, the clicky bit. It's got little bows on them and they're red. And oh my god, look how stunning it is. And look at the lining, it's actually beautiful and it's just such good quality. I've got like, oh I didn't even realise. I've got like space for like cash there and then I have two pockets there as well and then I have space for cash there. So in all I have like five pockets. Oh, I have six, one on the back, which also has this fabulous lining in, which I love. And I just love this purse so much. Ooh. So that was exciting. Then she also got me this Gemma Kid makeup bag. She bought me, she spoiled me so much this year. Um, and in there it came with Gemma Kid Makeup School Ultra Soft Cleansing Wipes. So I can use them as travel wipes. And all of these came in boxes, but I've just unpackaged them. This is a face bronzing tray, and I saw this in Chico Max, and I was thinking about getting it. So, yeah, it's just really nice. I love the colour in the middle. I think that's such a pretty colour. Anyway, and it's got a really nice mirror. Ooh, if you saw that, I don't know if you did. I love the packaging for this. Then, um got an eyebrow kit that I couldn't figure out how to open but I can now. So you pop this side and then you have to slide it open and it's got a colour, I'm assuming it goes this way, auburn, chestnut and honey and then it's got a pair of pink tweezers and it says Gemma Kid on them, you won't be able to see it but yeah and then it comes with a teeny weeny brush so you can go like that. So yeah and even if your eyebrows aren't um, the lightest colour you can always use that for like a, as a highlight so or eyeshadows you could use them as a as a, this is a little eyeshadow kit but yeah that I thought that'd be really good to pop in your bag or in my bag then this is just a nude lipstick I'm not too keen on the packaging but I'm not complaining um it's a nude kind of colour it's really nice it's just more of like adding a gloss and a teeny bit of colour to it. But yeah. Then a semi-permanent lash tint. And I'm a bit worried to use this. 
because it said lash tint, so I don't know if it's just another word for mascara. But it's in this beautiful packaging. I love pink and black together. I think it's lovely. And then that's the brush. Not a real fancy brush, but it might be for this purpose, like specifically. So yeah. Then I got this Stardust Cream, and it's in Comet. And basically, I would call it just like a pencil eyeshadow. And it's like really nice taupe. And it's got quite a bit of glitter in. But it's really nice. So yeah, that is everything I got from my family on that side. And I was really, really excited when I got everything. And I was so happy with it. And obviously, I was really appreciative of it too. Um, thank you for watching this video, taking time out of your day to watch um, probably like a 10 minute video. I uh, hope you like my Christmas attire, even though it's not Christmas anymore. But yeah, uh, thanks for watching and have a great day. Bye!